This video, released by the Ukrainian Security Service, allegedly shows a million euros changing hands. The SBU says a Russian man gave the money to Ukrainian businessman Timofey Nahorny. The man said he was paying for help with the upper echelons of the Russian security establishment. The SBU alleges that Nahorny was defrauding the Russian man and was a Kremlin agent. The video was shot in early October. Nahorny and two Russians were arrested soon after. 3 the SBU says Nahorny was committing fraud because he had no intention of helping the Russian man. It says that while conducting the fraud investigation, it stumbled across Nahorny's Kremlin connection. Ukrainian intelligence officers believe that Nahorny was arrested after a peace protest in Moscow in 2014 by Russia's FSB security service, which recruited him shortly afterwards. They presented an audio recording of him talking to an SBU informer. Nahorny's main task, according to the charges against him, was political. It's alleged he was to form a political party to promote the Kremlin's interests in Kiev and destabilize Ukraine. The SBU presented an undated video purportedly showing him discussing this with another informer. Nahorny refers to senior figures in the government of Ukraine's former pro-Russia president, Viktor Yanukovych. There's no indication that such lofty ambitions were ever realistic, but Ukrainian prosecutors believe there is enough evidence to convict Nahorny. On October the 22nd, a court in Kiev reversed an earlier decision to grant him bail. It was the same day the SBU released their video and audio recordings. Nahorny denied the charges against him. The court ordered Nahorny to be held in custody until November the 30th. The SBU says it has more information it can't disclose while the investigation continues. More details as to his guilt or innocence may surface when Nahorny's case goes to trial.